Yeah, we traded tapes in the morning. I haven't had uh, time to get through all of them, but uh, Tanawanda has a fairly good passing game. Um, I'm not sure of his name yet because I didn't get the roster, but number 85, he's he's pretty good uh, receiver. Uh, they have a good running back in number 33. Uh, they mix it up pretty good and uh, keep you surprised with the pass and the run up the middle. Have you gotten a chance to look at much from Tanawanda yet? Um, we got three films last night and we watched a little film. We'll go over it today with them, though. What do you think you're going to see from them? Um, it, they have quite a few formations. Like, they run some power, and then they'll, they'll spread it out on you. So we just got to be ready. What got you to start playing football? You obviously haven't played the last few years. You didn't start the year with the team. What kind of convinced you to come out and be a part of the football team this season? Well, it's my senior year, and people talked me into it because I'm a senior and I won't be able to play again. And also, I've been working out for basketball. I wanted to do that, and that's why I wasn't playing football. So then at the start of the school year, I started working out at 5.30 in the morning before school, so I've had time in the afternoon, so I decided I could play football. Coming into this season, did you expect to have the type of year that you've had so far? Um, Not at all, honestly. When I first came into the season, I thought I was expecting to be a wide receiver, but then I just got thrown in at back, started getting some reps there, and I ended up doing pretty good. So how have you been able to get over 1,000 yards? I mean, what are you able to do out there, especially thinking you were going to come and play in receiver? Well, my line, basically. They always open up those holes for me. I just do my part by running hard, and if it wasn't for them, they open up the holes. And the receivers blocking downfield, they did a great job for that, too. And what do you think the best run you've had this year is? My 99-yard run. <laughs> That's one I always remember. Teams are really starting to key in on you. How are you going to be able to continue to get these yards? Um, I'll just keep doing what we do. And if it doesn't work out, we'll just give it to someone else. Our team, my other teammates will be able to do something with it too, no doubt. As long as we continue to execute, and our, our biggest advantage is uh, we don't make too many mistakes. Uh, and if the weather is as predicted, that's going to be a big thing. Turnovers and mistakes will dictate this game.